Just over there is where the Tropic of Capricorn hits Africa. This is the start of my journey around the world, following the line that marks the southern border of the tropics. This is Namibia, on the west coast of southern Africa. 20 years ago, this country was ruled by apartheid South Africa. Now it wants to present a very different face to the world. Namibia is becoming a top destination for adventure travel, and young entrepreneurs are harnessing some of the world's biggest sand dunes for the latest sports craze, sandboarding. How are you? Thank you, how are you doing? OK. This looks a bit steep. Yes, this is the bunny slope. The, the bunny slope. The baby one. Baby yeah. slope. The, the bigger ones, we have to go a bit higher still. <laughs> I'll just try and stay on it, OK? Close no problem, yeah. But that's, that's the high-tech speed machine. That's the fastest on the dune, yeah. <laughs> no need for expensive equipment. I'm trusting my safety to a piece of hardboard. How, how fast can you go on the board? The fastest you can go is about 75 to 80 kilometers an hour. 75 to 80 km, yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Make sure you keep the front of the board up all the time. As soon as you put your hands down, sand's gonna come in your face. Not so pleasant. Yeah. Not good. So keep the mouth closed, yeah? Okay. What, what do I have to do? Face with this terrifying slope, I forgot everything I'd just learned. Ah! I'm eating the sand! Hold it to the edge! Yes! Ah! That was fun! Another go. I have to have another go. Despite the excitement, traditional ski resorts do have some advantages. This is why this is never going to take off, because every time you have to climb back up the bloody dune. 